Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can integrate QuickBooks with Stripe. First things first, we need to create ourselves an account at quickbooks.com and log into it or if you have a QuickBooks account already, just log into it. Uh, we can go to the top left, oh, to the left corner of our screen, sorry, and straight down and click on apps. As you can see, there's a couple of apps that we can use to integrate QuickBooks uh, directly. Uh, sadly, uh, there is no Stripe, so we have to find ourselves uh, a substitute app just to make this uh, this integration work. At Auto, uh, let's use automate.io. I will leave the link in the description underneath this video. At automate.io, we want to go to the top corner of our screen and we want to head to integrations. When this pop-up window show up, let's go to the bottom left part and click on see all categories. Now we can search from 200 more apps, but we want to start with QuickBooks like this. As you can see, QuickBooks is already integrated. Let's uh, try and find Stripe like this. Uh, straight away, you get some uh, advices for popular integration. But if you won't be able to find the one that you're looking for, keep scrolling down and you can create your own integration here. On the left uh, side, uh, there are triggers. Just remember to use uh, your uh, use QuickBooks first. So as you can see, there's a Stripe and QuickBooks. We have to, on the left side, pick uh, QuickBooks from many, many options. On the right side, on the other hand, you want to go with uh, Stripe. So let's stick to the first one. Now we only have to hit Try It Now button. We get redirected. And the last thing we have to do is to sign in to your automate.io account. And that's about it. Uh, we can also use Zapier.com. At Zapier, uh, it basically works the same. Once we created an account, let's go to the top left corner of our screen. Click Make a Zap. And we also have to start with the trigger. The trigger, as you probably guessed, will be at QuickBooks Online. Trigger event, stick to the first one, new account, continue. Uh, we have to log in with the account that we created just for this reason, continue. And now we can test our trigger. Or we can hop straight into second action, which will be Stripe, like this. We have to choose event now. We have like four to pick from, continue. And the last thing is we have to sign in to Stripe to make this integration work. So that's about it. Thanks for watching and see you on the next video.